Hi, this is Adam, a small town machine shop. Today we're going to attempt a little repair here. This is part to a, a clay valve, control valve, part of the piloting to it. And what has happened, you see the water has leaked by and ate away at this seal or this uh, sealing surface there. Now here's the other part. You can see where it ate into there. This we can clean up and clean this up no problem. Just take a file and scuff it off. And they've already replaced this with a new one. So this is kind of for a backup part. So what we're going to do is I think there's enough meat left. We'll chuck this up in the lathe and just give it just the barest hint of a cut. Try to take most of those ridges out there. Hopefully we'll be able to take them all off. As you can see, it doesn't sit very proud of that. Especially right there. I guess that's just a shadow. And we can take this down because there's more flex in this. There's plenty of, you know, if we take 20, even 30 thou, this will make up for it. There's plenty of flex in this. That sits down in there like so okay now I think I can turn it yeah you could braise this and build it up but they just want to see if you know this can be made a backup on the shelf while uh, waiting for others okay let's see what we can do I'll bring you back on the lathe okay I got it indicated in my tool ready have a little slightly more precarious grab on it than I would like. But we're still grabbing a good half inch of it. It's looking good. Let's turn the lathe on real quick. That little bit of run out you see on the back is the casting, but the machine surface is running within about a thou. So, I'll get you set up and we'll feed in there and we'll just take a little bit of a bite at it and see what happens. Okay, I'll bring you back. Okay, let's uh, fire the lathe up and let's see what we can do. Make sure we're clear. It is barely hitting, which is good. Back out.
just the barest hint left. <laughs> Actually, I think I'm going to call that good. Now I'll shut off the lid and we'll go over to the bench. Okay, here we go. Shine drip a bit, a little bit of scotch bright. It's nice and flat. Yeah, there's three or four little divots. They don't go to the edge. Remember, this is a backup piece in case they need one. Other ones have been ordered. Still got a nice ridge around there. All the way around. So, yeah. Turned out good. To get those last ones out, I'd probably have to take the whole thing off. But, uh, if you don't know anything about these valves, as long as the incoming, there's a restriction fitting before this, so as long as more can't leak by than is provided by the restriction fitting, it'll seal. And that will, I am 100% confident that that would work no problem. I have a lot of experience with these valves. There's a nice shoulder there. And I forgot where I put the other, the diaphragm, the rubber part, but I'll get that cleaned up and we'll get her out the door. Again, yeah, another quick little project. I've been trying to show you guys more machining stuff. This is the kind of stuff that comes through my shop. This is Adam for Small Town Machine Shop. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.